Hello Mzansi and welcome to Hot Mzansi. Family, friends, residents and members of Operation Dudula gathered at Pimville Community Center on Saturday for the funeral of Homoto Diale. Residents have been urged not to take revenge for his murder. Homoto, who was also a community leader, was shot and killed during a meeting between Pimville and Chicken Farm Squatter Camp residents over allegations of cable theft on Monday. Police presence remained high as mourners believed to be members of Tudula discharged firearms during a funeral proceedings as part of bidding and farewell. Addressing mourners, community leader Tabang Moloi said, I plead with you to let go of revenge and engage with your government and give it time to resolve our issues. Tabang also apologized to Homoto's family for their loss, adding that he was also scared for his life. In his statement he said, we never meant to leave Homoto behind. We all ran because we were scared. We didn't understand what was happening because we went there to talk, one community to another. Sharing on days leading up to Homoto's death, he said electricity had been going on and off. Then they later learned that chicken farm residents, mostly Lesotho nationals, were allegedly stealing cables. They decided to hold a meeting. Tabang said upon arrival, he decided to lead talks. He spoke to the men dressed in sort of traditional blankets in their own shared language. But all hell broke loose. He added that rifles, including AK-47s, were repeatedly and randomly fired. Both Tawang and Lux said there were rumors that a particular group of people were coming for them. Lux urged the community not to strike back, saying the office of the presidency of Lesotho is called to apologize. In a statement, he said, We're in this mess today because our leaders, who thought brown envelopes were better than people, were not going to make this battle about Basoto versus South Africans, but we're going to deal with the criminals.